there is where the bath is and we'd have to cross this This is the rest day, we've had breakfast and lunch did nothing this morning but we're going to go down now to Bormio which is in the valley and we're going to go to some hot springs that have been, well they've been there forever I guess but they've been used by Romans all the way back then so we're going to go there and have some recovery and get some snacks and I think that's it and we're going to meet Gabe, Gabe's coming as well we're going to meet Gabe, the new, not the, the new old teammate we're driving down the Stelvio Pass which is it is or was the best road in the world, voted by somebody. I don't know who it was voted by. I'm not big into cars. But yeah, it's been a very impressive road. And I'm not driving it very fast in the van. We've got to put the GoPro on the outside of the car so you can see this amazing road. Amazing road that I don't know anything about. This way? Let's hope it doesn't fall off. Rate this pass. Rate this pass. What do you rate Sylvia Pass at? It's the best 10? pass I've been up. Ten. Ten. Uh, ten. Uh, my experiences of passes, it's a ten. Top ten. Maybe. Mm, seven point three. Seven. What was the best pass you've been up to? I would well, be able to show Finley. No, no, no others. Oh, you but just, I just, you just think feel it's better out there. Better, yeah. Red light. Red light. One time we had a coach who didn't see the red light and went straight through the tunnel. And we had a little bit of a almost collision. So we're gonna go to there's like two different spots. There's this bottom one, which is always often quite busy, but there's a top one. We think it might be too wet, like the water, there's too much water to get up to it because we have to cross the river. So we're gonna go see see what we get. Let's probably go, shouldn't yeah. be advertising this route up in this quite deep. Too much water to go up today, unfortunately. So we're going to go to the normal one, the little one down there. There is where the bath is, and we'd have to cross this to get up there and climb some boulders. I think we're going to give it a miss. I think we should do it. Oh, yeah. Do you think we should do it? No, 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 I don't, I don't. No. no. So we're going to go to the, the little one down here. But we probably won't film much because there's quite a few people and we don't want to ruin their nice spa experience. So we'll see you later on, I guess. So we've just been in the hot springs. It was quite busy, quite intimate with some <laughs> strangers. <laughs> but it was all right, it was good fun. Um, and now we're gonna get some more snacks before we head up to the pass again. sort of snacks I got from the shop. I got some fruit juice because I wanted to <laughs> don't know. Got some fruit juice, some bananas, some fruit's always good. Two sets of bananas. I love a banana. Bananas are great. Um, what else did I get? It is actually Finley as who you've met many many times. It's birthday so we've got him. He loves brownies. 
these ones in particular, apparently they're very good. Actually, he gave me one, he bought a pack himself. But I bought him some extra and a card. He's gonna be 19, but it wasn't a 19 year old's card, so we got him a nine. I'm gonna draw one, because I don't even know what it means in Italian. And it means this, any, any Italian speakers, so that's what, it's for Finley, it's not for me. I got some chamomile and honey tea because I don't drink a lot when I'm up at altitude and if it's a little bit tastier, I sometimes drink more. So I'm gonna use that. I got a Kit Kat because I'm probably the best as an athlete, but we're all human, eh? So I got a Kit Kat and I had that on the way up and then I got a couple packets of licorice, which I know is pretty controversial. I'm probably gonna get a lot of hate for having licorice, but I love licorice, not Haribo licorice. Haribo licorice is the worst thing ever. The proper licorice is the best. And I'm looking forward to going to Nor Norway, no Sweden, at Christmas because there's lots of licorice there and I'm gonna buy so much. But to be honest, you don't need much snacks up here. They're pretty good at feeding you pretty well. Some other places you sort of, you're like surviving on snacks. I'm gonna grab a shower. I'm gonna scrape my GS skis because we've skied some GS on the long boards, which is something we've not done for a while, which is exciting. Looks like it should be quite good. Today looked quite good, but um, we needed a rest, so. Yeah, Gabriel, he's arrived. <laughs> Is the GS helmet fit on with that? Oh, one? yeah, all the time. The GS helmet's bigger than the GS helmet's huge. Gabe yeah, was here last season with me. He's my best friend ever. My best friend. <laughs> it is the end of the day off. We're oh, yeah. scraping skis. We left it a little bit late. We had a nice relaxing day. And everyone else is playing. I thought we were like, they're obsessed. <laughs> These two are really nice. I just had a few bunch of numb skulls on my hand. Gonna get that out of camera. I thought it was great. Every time I have Gabe's knocking everything over. They go for the ears. And now it's time for bed because I've done my skis. I'm done playing the whole game. Can I have a brush, please? <laughs>